Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are keeping well. I'm very excited today because today's video is all about Pat McGrath Labs. Pat McGrath herself is a celebrity makeup artist and she has recently launched her brand in India at Nykaa and I'm super excited because I had so many of her products which I could not use before because they were not available in India but in today's video I'm going to use all Pat McGrath makeup products and create a really nice soft everyday makeup look with a red lip. One of her red lipsticks is an eye iconic red lipstick and i'm going to use that in my today's video also i'll be announcing another giveaway in my today's video so guys stay tuned till the end of this video to know the giveaway and yeah let's get started with today's video now i've already prepped my skin and i'm going to start directly with the foundation and i'm using my pat mcgrath's skin fetish sublime perfection foundation in the shade light 7 this foundation is not yet available on nika but i'm hoping that they will be uh, because the concealer and the powder and everything else has already been launched on nika but um, the foundation has still not been so first let me show you the packaging it comes in a cardboard box like this just look at that beautiful black packaging with golden details and then you open it like this and inside you get the foundation and uh, the actual component of the foundation is just gorgeous just look at that matte bottle and it's pretty heavy in weight and it looks just like a piece of jewelry with that beautiful black cap and the golden detailing i have used this before this is not the first time i'm using it and it's a beautiful uh, medium coverage foundation i'm just taking out two pumps of it on the back of my hand and you can see it has a pretty runny and a very um, liquidy kind of a texture and will give you a nice medium coverage i'm going to first dot it all over my face and then blend it out using my pack 231 foundation brush now this foundation is supposed to give you a medium ish cover light to medium coverage and uh, it is super 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 lightweight on the skin it will not give you a very dewy foundation look it will give you a nice soft matte look and uh, it blends out like a dream and it looks super 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 lightweight on the skin just looks like your skin and even looking up close you will not feel that I'm wearing any foundation or any you know product on my face uh, once I've blended it out with my foundation brush I'm going over with my beauty sponge to soak up any excess and to give it an even more natural finish Let me zoom you guys in to show you the finish of the foundation and uh, looking up close you cannot even feel that I'm wearing anything on my skin. Just look at that beautiful soft matte finish and it is still looking nice and natural while covering up any unevenness on the skin and uh, I absolutely love the finish of this foundation. Next up for the concealer I'm using the Pat McGrath Skin Fetish Sublime Perfection Concealer in the shade number L7. This is what the packaging looks like. It again has that nice black and gold detailing and this is what the concealer looks like. It's a nice, it also is a glass packaging and, and the doe foot on it is a nice um, short wand which makes it really easy to apply the concealer. I'm going to apply it on my under eyes and on the center of my face just the usual areas that I like to highlight and conceal on my face and then to blend it out I'm using my elf flawless concealer brush now this again is a product that is famous worldwide for its texture um, you can see it has instantly brightened up my face and the texture on this is really nice and you know very creamy um, it does not look drying or cakey on my under eyes I have heard so 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 many international youtubers just rave about this concealer and it is for a good reason it is absolutely beautiful and it gives a very 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 nice and a very natural look on the face let me zoom you guys in and uh, this again is not creasing as bad on me but this one does settle quite fast so you need to you know work faster with this or you need to work one eye at a time and uh, it will give you a beautiful 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 medium to full medium coverage and uh, it just blends out like a dream now i'm going to set it out with my Too faced peach perfect powder because i do not have the setting powder from pat mcgrath and again i'm taking the tiniest bit of it on my beauty sponge and i'm using it just on my under eyes and on the center of my face now i quickly go ahead and fill in my eyebrows off the camera and then i'll be right back with you to finish off the rest of my face makeup 
and I'm back I also went ahead and added a little bit of bronzer on my face because I do not have a bronzer from Pat McGrath and I believe she does not even have a bronzer in her range so I've already added my bronzer and coming on to the blush I have her Pat McGrath Labs Divine Blush and I have it in the shade desert orchid just look at that beautiful packaging i mean just it's amazing it opens like this and then inside you have the same black packaging with golden details to it and uh, it actually feels luxe and you know very heavy and very expensive now obviously pet mcgrath uh, products are expensive but the packaging the quality and everything else about her products are absolutely top notch now this is what the actual blush looks like just look at that beautiful engraving on the blush itself and uh, i absolutely love the packaging and everything about this blush now i'm going to apply it on my face as well as on my eyes because i do not have one of her eyeshadow palettes but i do have a single eyeshadow from her but that is a very you know a metallic golden which i didn't want to use today so i'll just apply the same blush all over my eyelids as well and just look at that beautiful 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 shade it's a beautiful neutral peachy kind of a shade and it has a beautiful glow to it as well i mean you do not even need a highlighter with this product it is that glowy and you know very 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 beautiful on the face isn't this blush just beautiful i absolutely absolutely love this blush the formula the texture everything about it is beautiful it's a powder blush but rub your finger in it and feel like a cream and it's super 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 soft and very easy to apply it's beautifully pigmented and gives that beautiful you know blushing from within kind of a look on the face i also do not have her mascara in my collection so i'm going to use my Kiko Milano Lost in Amalfi 24 hour lasting click mascara and I'm going to add two to three coats of this on my eyelashes. And lastly for the lips I have one of her most iconic and one of her most best selling uh, products in her range. This is the Pat McGrath Matte Trans Lipstick and I have it in the shade Elsin. I have more shades in this lipstick with me but this is one of her best 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 selling shades and it is a stunning 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 red. First let me show you the packaging it again comes in a cardboard box like this you have this um, thread kind of uh, opening to it open this and then inside you have the beautiful packaging it again is a black bottle with gold detailing just look at that beautiful lip engraved in it and then this is what the bullet looks like I wish I could show you how stunning it looks in real life it just looks like a velvety um, texture and it's beautiful it's just beautiful the formula the texture on this is just amazing it is a matte lipstick but will just glide on your lips like anything you do not have to rub it all over your lips it is just a one swipe kind of a lipstick and it's very 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 hydrating on the lips it is not a transfer proof formula by any means it will transfer a tad bit when you eat or drink something but it will last you a really good amount of time just look at that beautiful shade it is one red lipstick that will suit absolutely every skin tone and um, it again is a universally flattering kind of a red and I absolutely absolutely love this red from her and so yeah guys that is it for today's video this is my take on an everyday fresh makeup look with a beautiful bold red lip that you can definitely wear even to your office or for a daytime or even a nighttime outing and it will look absolutely beautiful super quick very easy to do and all of the Pat McGrath products that I've showed you in today's video are just top notch i know pat mcgrath is quite an expensive brand but the quality the packaging the effect and you know the the way it looks on the skin it is just absolutely stunning and if you want to invest in some good high-end products pat mcgrath is one brand that you would absolutely absolutely love and not regret buying at all so yeah well that is it for my video now let's get into the giveaway so for my giveaway this time i have this beautiful eyeshadow palette from la colors this is the sweet 16 color eyeshadow 
and it has some beautiful neutrals and even some brighter colors in the palette and along with this you will also be getting the LA color so cheeky blush and highlight palette which again has a wide variety of shades for the blush and highlighters as well these two palettes are beautiful and you know they are palettes that will suit just any skin tone and they are perfect for creating a more subtle and even a glam makeup look so the rules for the giveaway will be given in the description box as always and i'll be announcing the winner three weeks from today and i would love for all of you guys to participate in my giveaway this is just my way of giving back for all of my subscribers and all of your guys' love and support so thank you once again and yeah if you haven't still subscribed to my channel already please do like and share my videos and i'll see you guys in my next video thank you bye bye